Welcome back to Trash Panda Sports. Uh, today we're going to run through a couple vintage football pack openings. Uh, we got two 1978 Tops football in front of you. That's going to be uh, Tony Dorsett's rookie season, I believe, uh, as well as a couple other Hall of Famers in there that are worth some cash. Uh, also, we got some 1987 Tops packs. Um, I believe we've got a Jim Kelly, Herschel Walker, a couple other guys in that year. So let's get right into it. We'll start with the 87s uh, to save the drama for the 78s or whatever I said it was. Yeah, let's get rid of this. All right. J.T. Smith, Thousand Yard Club, Gerald Whitwhite. Chucky Long, Jim Burt, Warren Moon, Team Leaders Card, Sammy Winder, Chip Banks, Charlie Brown, Christmas Story, <laughs> Obi Brenner, Earl Farrell, Howie Long, Danny Fouts, Dennis Smith, Ken Jenkins, Tim Micaiah, I think it's Timmy Micaiah's rookie, and John Stallworth, Hall of Famer. All right, it's another 87 tops pack. Okay, oh, well, that's sad. You got a Leslie O'Neill rookie card, but look at that gum stain right on the back. That's why you hate seeing that card on the back, you know? Oh, but look, oh, Mike Shepard, I thought it was somebody else, but it's not. All right, what do we got here? Mark Dupa, 1,000 yard receiving, Lee Williams, Mark Clayton, Carl Hairston, Ray Childress. Rick Donnelly, Zeke Mowat, Willie Galt, Ray Donaldson, Seahawks, Team Cat, Gary Veris, Matt Boza, Dean Stinkholler, <laughs> Phil Freeman, and then the card that we already talked about is ruined. Right there, Leslie O'Neill. Look at it. It's it soaks through the entire card. That's just crazy. And that would have been a Look at the centering. Centering's great, too. That would have been a 10. Unbelievable. Oh, well. What are you going to do? That's what happens with these older cads. All right. That's why they call them junk wax packs. You know, junk cards. Because they sit so long and you got all this grease and they were overproduced. So uh, the value really isn't worth what it was. J.T. Smith, Michael Downs, Peppa Johnson. That's a rook. Philip Epps, Rulon Jones, Marty Lyons, El Tuno Pro, William Refrigerator Perry, Patriots Team Card, Gary Anderson, Roy Green, Cardinals, Neil Lomax, Mark Bavaro, Tops All Pro, Phil McConkey, Gerald Butler, and a checklist. One more 87 pack before we get into the vintage vintage. Okay. Man, and then this always this last card now sticking too. What is up with that? Okay. Alrighty, we got Bruce Hardy, Mark Bavaro, thousand yard, Gary James, top super rookie, Mickey Shula, Jim Breach, Lloyd Burris, Rob Riddick, Lewis Wright. Ralph Bernischke, Boomer Esiason, Kevin House, Darren Nelson, Jerry Ellis, Dan Marino. That's a good card. Danny Marino. Mike Reichenbach stuck to Rich Camarillo. Nothing crazy doing there. All right, so we didn't find too much there. But now we got these beautiful, as you can see from the back, 1978 Tops packs. We're looking for... Tony Dorsett's rookie card. So, fingers crossed, right? Big stick of gum on the back. All right, Jerry Goldstein, Lou Picone, James Scott, Tom Whittem, Stan White, 
Norm Block, Mike Haynes All Pro, Benny Cunningham, Ron Jaworski, Bob Avellini, Andy Johnson, Tom Darden, Gary Shirk, and Walter White. Not to be confused with Walter White from the TV show. Okay, last pack, 1978. Tops football, vintage pack, looking for door set. All right, Rich Saul, Dan Pfeiffer with his trucker hat on. Look at that guy. Glenn Walker, Lyle Isato, all pro. Wayne Morris, Gary Barbero, Rich Zaro, Dan Pastorini, John Leipold, Raphael Stepien, Thomas Henderson, Jim Marshall, Richard Todd, and Mike Haynes again, all pro. So nothing doing. Nothing crazy out of those packs. Couple uh, decent players. But I digress. You win some, you lose some. So we got the uh, Alzado all pro, the Jaworski. The Mike Haynes, uh, Boomer, Marino, Pepper Johnson, rookie, William Perry, Stallworth, Makaya, rookie, Fouts, and Howie Long. Nothing crazy, nothing of any significant value. Uh, so that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes, especially when you're dealing with these vintage packs. A couple things you got to worry about is one, finding the card, and two, the condition that it's in. Centering issues were rampant back then. Uh, and then you got to worry about just because they've been in these packs for so long, what kind of damage could be lurking underneath. So Trash Panda Sports, remember, subscribe, like, comment, and share. We're going to be giving away some cool stuff. So remember, if you haven't subscribed yet, click that button. Get your friends and family to do so as well and uh, increase your chances of winning some, some crazy things we're going to be giving away here. Trash Panda Sports, Trash Panda out.